Uh, Kaun because I was not playing with him all the time. Uh. Only by elementary years, I went to Elsta and stayed with them. Elementary would be what? The age 12 to 15? Uh, uh, like, like from 1 to... Then at 6, uh, at the time that 6 was from 1. Uh. So something like from 1 to from 3. Uh. Uh, 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 in the middle part of it. Uh. Then the secondary school is from from four, from five, or from that. six, uh, yeah, yeah, So uh, I studied up to from three there, and then transferred to Penang because at the time, also my father retired a bit. Oh, I see. So went up to Penang, ah. bought the Limen Ping Roads uh, house. Uh. And then when I started to spot everything, otherwise, it would be very rich already. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Was Akong a strict man? Not exactly very strict. Lah. Anyway, uh, <clears throat> he is quite the. Uh, I don't know. I was the only one who made him angry one day. <laughs> and he slapped me. Oh. I was more or less a black goat of the family. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> because every time uh, uh. when I stay there with them, Every morning, he would like to eat nasi lemak there, very famous one. Okay. So, I would be the one to be awakened early uh, to uh. go and buy for him the nasi lemak. Whereas, Tua Pear and Sa Pear uh, will be sleeping away nicely at least two hours. Uh. I see. So, I'm always uh, being told to do this and do that. And uh, that's why they studied more than I, I did. Uh. Okay. Uh. And besides that also, uh, at that time, as soon as I left school, uh. he got me the job as a teacher. Right. Because Tuape and uh, Sampe managed to, to go to U already. Right. So I had to come out and help with the area. So that's why I never went on to further studies. <coughs> and uh, among the three of us, of, of course, uh, I did all the donkey's job. <laughs> I studied less, and of course the, the worst of the three la, <laughs> when study is a concern. So when your daddy went to work in Kalantan, at that time I think he was looking for his uh, degree, I think. So he came to me to ask for some financial help. Huh. At that time I was citing the English book for for this thing. La. <coughs> some sort of English book for school. Uh. Right. And I managed to get a thousand, so I offered him that one thousand. How many English book? Eh? What, what English book is this? Um, just an uh, ordinary textbook type. Uh. You wrote? Uh, you you co-wrote it? Uh, or wrote uh, it yourself? I co-wrote it. Uh, co-wrote? With uh, the friend. Okay. And then uh, edited by one uh, lecturer of the teacher's college. I see. So a thousand dollars is a lot, but in fact then? Uh, that time was 19... what time? Uh? 19... Uh, yeah, was 1970 something, like he was what? What should see there? What the University? 1970. Early 70s, I would say. So I got a thousand uh, for being a co writer. Mm. Okay. And that time, the daddy came to uh, ask for financial help. It looks like your daddy and myself were the black sheep there. Ah. Eh? <laughs> the family. Eh? Ah. We, we are not uh, well taken, uh, what do you say, taken out by as a sibling. <laughs> so, I offered that help, but in the end, whether he took it or not, I forgot the idea. I think he did because he told me before that you supported him when when he was in university, he would come to Kuei. That's why I, I became a more or less help with the supporting of all the brothers. Yeah. Uh. That's why they are, I mean, uh, get unwell. Okay, good. Other than other. Yeah, good also. <laughs>